So I ended up getting some new pots and pans, and then 20 years went by. And here's how they look now. They're extremely dirty. They're hard to clean. Normally I just use a scrubbing brush and some soap, and they don't get that clean, but I found a better way to clean these pots and pans. Now I'm not saying it's the best way or that you should even attempt to do this, but I figured I'd try it out and see if I could get these pans to look a little bit better. But first, let's uh, see what I had to work with. So here's the frying pan I had and there's the bottom. Ah, oh, it just looks so bad. And a quick warning. So first thing I did was I grabbed my pressure washer. I have a DeWalt 3600 PSI and I grabbed the 15 degree tip and I placed the frying pan on a piece of wood and I tried to pressure wash it. And the force out of the water is quite powerful, but it didn't do anything. Couldn't take off any of the grease that was baked on there, so I switched to the zero tip. Normally the zero tip is junk, you just throw it away, it's too powerful. And I decided to try and pressure wash it with the zero tip. And amazingly, it still didn't do anything. I could not get that baked on grease off. So then I tried some easy off heavy duty oven degreaser. I sprayed the whole frying pan and let it sit on there for about three minutes before I tried to pressure wash it. And I was amazed. It actually uh, started to work. Some of the grease started to come off. Not all of it, but just a little bit. But that was only letting it soak in for about three minutes. So let's take a look at that. Yeah, it's starting to come off. So I decided to put some more on. I figured I'd let it sit in there for about 10, 15 minutes and see what happens then. I pressure washed it again and more of the grease came off. You can see how powerful this pressure washer is. It's actually tearing apart the wood that the frying pan's on. But still, I couldn't get all the grease off. So, let's take a look. Yep, it still has some grease on there. So I tried something different. I decided to try and heat the frying pan. And this is never good to do, to heat a frying pan and then to uh, try and pressure wash it, not a good idea. Don't recommend it at all. So I decided to put a little bit more of that easy off spray on. And I did it while it's hot. You can see how it's starting to smoke and everything. And then once I was done spraying it, I went straight into pressure washing it with the zero tip again. And I was amazed. Everything came off the pan. It was unbelievable how clean this frying pan is. Take a look at it can hardly tell that this frying pan is 20 years old but so I decided after looking at it maybe I should try this on another frying pan so I found another frying pan this one I don't use as much as the larger frying pan I decided to try something different this time I figured I was like well I'll just heat the frying pan We'll heat it up really hot and we'll spray it with the pressure washer. Sometimes when you spray a hot pan with cold water, sometimes the pan can warp. So really don't do this. And so I went ahead and I tried spraying the frying pan and now the grease came off. Duh, still seemed to be baked on there. So I went back to heating up the frying pan and if it would get really hot. Once we got the frying pan nice and hot, bring it outside, use some more of this easy off, heavy duty oven degreaser and we'll spray it. And you can already see some of it starting to come off, but if you would use the pressure washer instead of just water and using the pressure washer, it came right off. I was amazed at how this frying pan looks. So it's absolutely amazing, it works. But I'm telling you right now, this probably void your warranty on your all clad pans. I know there's like some kind of lifetime warranty on these pans. And I'm sure the company looks down on this. Well, anyways, if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. It'll keep you up to date on all my future videos. And leave a comment on what you liked or what you didn't like or what you'd like to see me work on next. Thanks again for watching.